There we go. Yep. Right. Uh, name, where you're from, and what you do. Uh, my name is Brian Godner. I'm from Warwick, Rhode Island, and I'm a VP of operations at a textile company. Okay. Um, how long have you been playing poker, and how long have you been with Eastern Poker Club? Uh, I've been playing poker since I was about uh, 16, and I've been playing the EPT for two years. Okay. Now, um, what does it mean to you that Eastern Poker Club gives all these opportunities for you to basically fulfill your dream of possibly becoming a millionaire, retire? And what does that mean to you? Uh, I think the EPT provides a, a fun atmosphere to enjoy poker. and. Uh, the prize at the end of the uh, rainbow is nice, but I just enjoy the events. Awesome. So, so what would you say is one of the most memorable experiences you've had with Eastern Poker Club? Um, it, probably the last two days. Uh, the grind, uh, the card rush. Uh, hopefully it's just about to happen, to be honest. I'm going to repeat the question. Repeat the question. Sorry. Uh, do you want to try that? No, nope, that one works. Actually, okay. works. What's the future? Okay. Um, let's see here. So you're at the final table. What's your strategy coming in to try to win the event? Uh, it'll. My strategy going into this tournament right now is just position raises. Just uh, any time an unraised pot's there, uh, you got to get it. You got to go get it. I see your favorite hand there is pocket eights. What makes pocket eights your, your favorite hand? I, I, I enjoy playing pocket eights because I usually set them up, you know, and uh, ace queen eights come and you get paid off. So, say you win tonight, you go to Vegas. What is your reaction when you step into that poker room with all those people, those millionaires, the, the Professional players, say you even get sat at uh, Phil Hellman's table. You know what, what's going through your mind when you're sitting there with, with all that pressure? Uh, if I make it to the World Series of Poker, um, I'd walk into the room probably pretty awestruck at first. But the realization is, stars are stars. They they breathe like you, and they play well. But uh, there's no intimidation factor. You just play good cards. Uh, now say. You exceed in that tournament, say you make it to the final table. You know there's a lot of money involved now. You probably have some endorsements and I mean really life changing money. What does that mean to you knowing that, that your life's gonna change? Uh, I really haven't thought it's too far out, you know what I mean? I don't uh, I, I pretty much stay in the moment all the time, so uh We'll say you're there. You're there in the moment. You have, you have already potentially won a million dollars. What is going through your head? I'm pretty debt free. <laughs> <laughs> That's honestly what would be going through my head, and uh, uh, that's I can't. Uh, we're all going to Disney World, so yeah. Now, uh, who's at home rooting for you? Who do you, who do you got in your cheering section there? Uh, my wife made the trip uh, today, and uh, uh, she's pretty special. Uh, one of my best friends when I was growing up says, Brian, you're never going to meet anyone who wants to play cards as much as you and watch football, let you watch as much football as you want. And, uh, yeah, my wife is that person. She's more competitive than me, as certainly when it comes to cards. She hates losing, and it's just a, it's a blast. Uh, so you've been playing with EBT for a little while. What's your favorite place and why? Uh, I, I like the Brickyard. It's right. I walk walk there from my house. It's absolutely my favorite uh, place to go to. Good atmosphere. Uh, like I said, it's right around the corner. It's a good place. Watch out for at the final table, you think? Uh, going into the final table, I really, uh, I'm not concerned about any of the players. I actually think uh, 
some of the big stacks uh, don't want to double people up, so if anything, as a, I, I might be targeting them just because uh, you can double up through them. And you have to win. There's no second place tonight, so uh, I'm playing to win. So why not go after them?